Hi, this is David with David's Tutorials, and I'm going to talk to you today about something many of you probably already know about, but I didn't know this until recently, and I've talked to several people and they didn't know about it either, so just in case, let me tell you about YouTube's queuing feature. Here we go. This is a feature that is very handy when you watch a YouTube video and you finish it up and you look over on the right hand side at your suggested videos and you see one you say, oh, that one looks good. I want to watch that. But then as you're getting ready to click it, you notice one farther down. Oh, that one looks good, too. Oh, wait, that one looks good. And that one looks good, too. And you're sitting there thinking, oh, man, if I watch this first one that I like, then I, these others will not still be on my suggested videos list. I'll have to maybe back up and hope they'll be there. Well. I've got the solution for you. It's the YouTube queuing feature. And a YouTube queuing feature is basically a temporary playlist that only lasts as long as you keep this tab open on YouTube. Now let me show you how it works. When you zoom in here so I can see it better, once you hover over a video, it shows these little symbols here. Well, the top symbol is watch later and what that does it adds it to your channel's watch later playlist but this second one here this is add to the queue and if you click that one notice everything changed but you go up to the top the current video is the top listing in the queue and the one you just clicked on is now the second listing in the queue now let's scroll back down a little bit more and see what else we've got. It doesn't matter what these are. I'm just going to click on some random ones, but we're going to think, ooh, I like that one. I want to watch it later. So I click on this one, and when we go to that, we'll notice that there's a little check mark next to that, and that is also up top in our queue. And there's the third one. And we're going to go ahead and we'll just pick one more here at random, whatever this one is. I'm going to click on that one. And now we have four videos in our queue and we're on number one of four of them. You can play any one of these just by clicking on it and it will stay in your queue until you close the tab. You can reorder your queue by just taking one of them and dragging it to a different position in the queue. And the interesting thing is if you click on this to play it, and I'm gonna click on it to play it, notice it's starting to play and once it goes all the way to the end, if you don't do anything, it will go ahead and automatically play the next one in your queue. You can stop it and you can come back and watch the end of your queue later on. Now, it's got a clear button here, and if you click that clear button, it doesn't do anything really except just close your queue, and it does not clear it out. You can go over here to the right-hand side of each one of these listings, and it says Save to Playlist, and you can save it any of the playlists in your playlist that you have designated, or you can save to watch later, which is, as I have said before, watch later is a playlist on your channel. And it says remove from playlist, and it does remove it from there. And if you find it down here in this queue again, it will still have the check mark on it. So you can't add it back onto this playlist. And that's basically the YouTube queue feature. And if you like it as much as I do and use it as much as I do, then you will probably have a fun time with it. Now, wasn't that something interesting? At least it was to me, and I found that I'm starting to use that a lot more lately. If you thought it was great, as many of the other people I've shown this to thought it was, go ahead, please, and give me that thumbs up so that I'll know and YouTube will know that you thought it was a great video. I will be encouraged, and YouTube will recommend this video to some other people. Meantime, leave me a comment down in the comment section. And if you're already a subscriber, thank you so very much. I appreciate every single one of you. And if you're not, you know what to do. If you're not a subscriber, go ahead right now, click that subscribe button and then the bell icon so YouTube will let you know by email when I post another great video right here on David's Tutorials and Vlog Channel. Meantime, have a great day, everybody. Take care, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.